I'm here. I'm a little bit late. Well, I'm not really late, but like I'm kind of like not here when I wanted to be. I'm 22 minutes past the time. Okay. Um, hello. I don't I think we're just going to get right into the game cuz I want to make sure we finish it. I really want to finish it. Hello. Today we're going to play Oxen Free. I've never played it. I actually have no idea what it's about. I've never watched anyone play it. I know nothing about this game, which is kind of crazy because I feel like a lot of people have played it and I think it's pretty popular. I think they also have a second one coming out soon. So, you know, yeah, I thought I would play it since there's a second one coming out eventually and then we could play that one once it comes out. But yeah, we're going to play this today. I know nothing about this game, nothing at all, so it's going to be new for me. Um, yeah, so I'm going to open it. I want to just get right into it. I want to make sure we finish it. I think this game is supposed to take like four to five hours. So yeah, it's not a long game. It's like kind of a story game, but I don't know what the story is about, if that makes sense. All right, oxen free. Ooh, this is cool. Whoa. Oxen free start. Did we just start right away? We just, we just get into it. Oh, okay. We definitely need to go to options. And we definitely need... Uh. 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 Uh, where's the volume? What? I can't turn- Oh! Whoops! Okay, we gotta open it again. <laughs> I accidentally closed the game. Okay, never mind. We're gonna load it up again. How do you turn the volume down? You just don't? My ears are like bleeding. Like blood dripping out of my ears. My ears bleeding. They're bleeding. Your honor, they're bleeding. Well, I hope it's not too loud for you guys. All right, I guess I guess we're just gonna play. I know nothing about this game, but we're just gonna play it and see what happens. It used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing. Then it was turned into an army thing. Then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit, unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. What? I missed all that. Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. My mind drifted. Yeah, my my mind drifted for a second. In real so life too. Did? Um not not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a... You know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> tell okay. me! No, wait, what happened? I feel like I haven't heard this. He got lost in some gardens, and he thought she worked there, and blah, 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 they hit it off. Aw, uh, that's downright adorable. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um... I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out. So. <gasps> what? Does that make you to her then? I can yeah. move. Second cousin. Step I don't know. Step brother. Know. Step brother. Oh yeah, I forgot that was even a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling, living right in your house, sharing your toothbrush, wearing your clothes. Eating your food. Yeah, sure, whatever. I have someone to reach the food on the top shelf now. Just happy to be on the team. So, how do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic, grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her. One sec. In a bathtub, and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blocks. <laughs> and to date, that's still what I think she looks like under her clothes. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Uh, so how do you 
It's a report. They always play. It. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be like the before show. Fine, just hold the camera out, like far. I don't look my freshest right now. It's true, Jonas. This is like D minus Alex, just for your uh, calibration. And it's Jonas, not Jonah. Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk, right? Patient zero, AIDS guy. Um, polio. Jonas. It means oppressor, right? Yeah, but I mean, my sign's cancer, and it's not like my hair's falling out or anything. Here's good. Come on, Alex, join the fun. We, uh, need the girl in the picture, Alex, to balance some of this out. To balance there, it there. out. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little portable one? Yeah, of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? This guy doesn't stop talking. There's the little... Whoops. Little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. She's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing, so tune 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. There's so much going on. Not a recent phenomenon. It's, uh, to the left of the dial? 88.3. Dude, shut up! I'm trying to hear the radio. Shut up! But the lump of all that is for me, it's 88.3. Which I played because that song's been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But, oh, oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so... Hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. We must be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. That guy needs to stop talking. He talks way too much. I can't even think. Aw, the selfie. That's so nice. I'm just there to balance out the picture with the boys. Just there to balance it out. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off me if you're empty. I forget if you're a fellow addict. Oh, uh, no thanks. I don't smoke. The last time I had one, it didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> okay, just checking. There's no option for the volume. Alright, my other friend should be up and around the bed. Actually, that. I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have like two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends? Uh, really? Just, that's kind of... It'll take three minutes. Uh, what could you possibly have to say that Ren can't hear? It's not like that. It's nothing, really. It's just something I want to talk to you about super fast, that's all. All right, bud. <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're going to have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all going to meet up with them. It's no, like... it's, it's fine, Ren. Go on up ahead and we'll catch up with you. Um... Okay, I guess. Though this is really what do you want, to dude? Off, splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. I'll just be up the hill in case. Whatever. Please don't tell me this game has this music playing the whole time. I can't do it anymore. My brain's gonna explode. 
Ren seems nice. He's funny, you know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. Yeah, he's... <sighs> Look, just what did you want to talk to me about before I suspect something nefarious? No, it's nothing. It's not bad. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And like getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels. Not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. Uh, we'll make do. Lemons, lemonade, however that goes. An optimist. Oh, Christ. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so this is... Yeah, it... no problem. Anytime. I hear you're in jail. Your mom's dead. It's nice at night, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. We can catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. Okay. The flag is flying. We are flying. Um, I think it's supposed to say running. Oh. These interactions are so weird. Off-road store. Kind of kitschy, right? It's kind of kitschy. Yeah, it's like a quiche. Block this off at night since nobody needs to use it. Or maybe they just had a parade? Sure. Either one. Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Oh, there's always that one lonely car in every parking lot. What? What is happening? And this music better stop. I can't do it anymore. Oh. Oh. Come on, it started over. Okay, this game would be better if they just let us listen to the ASMR footprints. Oh, my God. I actually have a headache. Hello, kids. Look, the other guys and gals must be further up, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid, a tradition apparently started by board recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal town. They literally called it trawling. Uh -huh. The beaten path officially ends here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over- Ah! Okay. Oh, a moment of silence. That music. Please don't tell me the music plays the whole time. Like, can I just turn it off? Okay, so we're right here. Edwards Island, that's where we are. For a guided tour, tune into station 1023. Okay, so we're going on a little tour. There's people here, though. Look, there's two people showing up on the map. So we're here in the town, and we're going to hike this way. I think that's the whole point of the game. Over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not, I mean, it can't be too difficult. Well, look, there must be something. I mean, Jerry got over. Yeah, exactly. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. Anyways, the town's youths keep the whole slink over and camp thing alive and well. No, 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 I, um, I, I got it. Uh, yeah, isn't this supposed to be like a giant swarming animal mask wearing freakout? Where's everybody else? Jesus, Alex, it's just supposed to be like a somewhat oversized kegger, and I think more people are. I guess we're going to the cliffs. These people don't stop talking, and the music doesn't stop my head. 9 p.m. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Who's that? That's, so, there's this girl, Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me, so just, you know, j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything, all right? Deal? Ren, relax. Oh, and okay, Jonas, 
Now that we're dumpster buddies, what was the thing that you said to Alex back there? Do you have one of those vestigial tails or something? Uh, it was nothing, really. <laughs> what? Ah! What's ah! Oh, I hate nature. Stupid birds with their stupid flying and pooping everywhere. <laughs> okay. Hey, is this like a part of the base? This far out on the beach? I honestly don't know what that is. But remember, you can pull out your little radio and tune to that tour station if you want. How do I pull out the radio? Okay, here's the map. Uh, 1023. How did I pull out the radio? This data command annex, as it had been. Communications protection through the invention of the famed wall system. A type of radio frequency identification, wall, standing for wave assisted lock, assigned each person who was stationed at Fort Milner a call sign through which they could use their portable two-wave radios to unlock prescribed doors and gates. Though the mechanics are considered outmoded today, the island still uses this security method to honor its rich history. This data command annex, as it had been dubbed, was used during the base's early years as the communication nerve center for outside military installations. It was also the primary office of Marianne Bozek, a civilian who developed communications protection through the invention of the famed wall system. A type of radio frequency identification, wall, standing for wave assisted lock, assigned each person who was stationed at Fort Milner a call sign through which they could use their portable two-wave radios to unlock prescribed doors and gates. Though the mechanics are considered outmoded today, the island still uses this security method to honor its rich history. This data command annex, as it had been dubbed, was used during the base's early years as the communication nerve center for outside military installations. It was also the primary office of Marianne Bozek. A oh, I've already watched that. Okay. Or listened to that. So we can't information on things on our hike. So that doesn't really mean anything to us. This building, I don't think we have to do anything about it, right? How do I, uh... Where do I go? How did this guy get down here? Can we go this way? Oh, we just jump. Gary, how did the path end up like this? We Reginald, I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying... I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car? Oh, well... Hey. We started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Hi. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you? Jonas. That's Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother? Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Uh. Yeah, I... he's a cool guy from cool North Valley, so let's all try and show him a good time. <laughs> Just the beach and some beer will be enough, I'm sure. Wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but are she's... your stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um, My mom married his dad, so family, law, and all. How don't they know? Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Uh, who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> We took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? <laughs> That's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Ugh, come on, Clarissa. I'm fun. I'm hip. I'm with it. Listen to yourself. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Rhett into, like, a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting the picture now. 
You see, Jonas, normally this is like a 20 deep rager, but Pat had a party last weekend and... And a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, right? We're on Edwards Island. Forget those losers who couldn't handle the weekend. Who didn't think we could make it? Shut up! That guy doesn't stop talking. I am so confused. I don't understand what's happening. The beach. Aw, oh, the beach. So nice. Fire. Man's great equalizer. So, what's the, um, what's the, like, thing to do here? Other than, obviously, go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Yeah, I think it's just whatever. Yeah, let's just get drunk. It's supposed to be a party, right? Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Oh, that's sort of a bummer. Yeah, well, we all gotta go sometime. In her case, later than sooner. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember what? where you are. What? This fire's bigger than them! Yeah, sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Truth or slap? What's that? We used to call it hippo. Until we got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Because you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo, before you slap someone. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth. But if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, I'm the truthiest truth whoever All truthed right, let's uh, just get on with it. OK, so first, we're going to. I'll start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa. Wait, wait, wait. I want to hear his answer. Uh... Marissa, come on. You're supposed to ask, like, have you ever stole something? Not super weirdo probing stuff. You ask probing stuff if you play the game right, Alex. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something mm -hmm. like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no, just face it. I, I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just like her as a friend. That's, that's all. She's cool. She's... All right. Great. Let's just move on. Okay. I don't care Twister, who he likes. Right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> Uh-oh. I just have to think about which nerve I want to so delicately pinch. Oh, please. Shoot, I can take it. Okay. Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? <laughs> it's fun. It's funny, I don't know. And Jonas is family now, technically. So he's excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. Mm -hmm. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, I think. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. Who'd you do the dirty with? Marissa, obviously. <laughs> obviously. You're not going to call her out on that? No, I believe her. I mean, look at me. And wait. Wait, that means you kill me? Yeah. Out of everyone here, your best friend. Hey, you wanted to know. And I'm the only guy. This is Miss Andrea. Miss Andrea, I said. Okay, settle down. So, Alex's turn? Yep, lady's choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great, here we go. Mm. What's your favorite stuffed animal? Nona! Because... Nona. <laughs> yes? All right, let's uh, make it something uh, fun and easy. So, does Clarissa ever do anything that just, like, really annoys the crap out of you? <laughs> Think carefully now. Um, you sometimes tap your nails on things when you're kind of bored. <laughs> what? I barely do that. Huh. I knew there had to be something. Okay, all right, huzzah, you got me. Let's just get on with it. Um, Nona, you're up. Oh, uh, Clarissa. If you had to get a tattoo, what would it be? Hmm. A chick riding a motorcycle on fire. She didn't ask you. A dolphin, right? Or a butterfly with like a Native American poem written above it. I'd get like a little ampersand on my ring finger. I think I actually am gonna get that after I move out, so my parents can't say no. Me. Clarissa's turn now. Alex, you got a new brother. Pretty exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm, um... Is there, like, a question coming, or what? I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. 
that statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably gonna get divorced again. And the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So let's put his mind at ease and hear why. I, I don't I don't really need to- Carissa, Jonas is fine. He's not a scared puppy. None of that matters. Well, let's hear why your parents got a divorce in the first what? place, and we'll see if it matters. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a divorce. Just that Alex's mom is happy now. This isn't fair. Like, at all. Of course it's fair. Why'd your parents get divorced? I know you know That why. is so rude. Go to Go hell. hell. That's my answer. Happy? Yeah, I won the turn. Of course I'm happy. All right, you know what? Let's just stop the game, okay? I think everyone's ready to do something else. Wait, let's... Let's not stop like this. We should like- Game's over, Ren. I won. And to celebrate, I'm gonna sit on the beach and drink and maybe, if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we could and get- And that's exactly what Nona's gonna do too. Oh my god, you are annoying. This isn't me being annoying. This is me being tired. There's a difference. She is annoying. Cheese. If you guys in your scavenger she hunt is. or playing Ring Around the Rosie <laughs> happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. Super. Uh, if we find anything more interesting than that, I think we'll be too involved in our own fun to come get you. Well, wouldn't you know it, that's just fine by me. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Nona, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? Well, like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. I want to go. It's a small town near North Valley. Oh yeah, is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Can I go? Alex, you want to check out the caves or? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up. Get yeah, me a come on. Get me away from Clarissa. Anywhere but here. Come on. I'll push you over. <laughs> oh. Oh, I forgot. Whenever Never you're ready. About John. Oh, what, their date? So, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of one to ten, how weird's it gonna be? Mmm. Mmm, probably a five. Weird enough to remember, but not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. <laughs> All right. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Yeah, what's her deal anyway? I don't know. That woman's perpetually on her period. Uh. Ren, I'm standing right here. Oh, please you don't know, make period jokes, dude. Thanks for uh, not. You me out don't to, uh, know the, what it's like. I didn't think you would, but you know you could have and you didn't, so thanks. Yeah, Ren, about Nona. What? Did she say anything? Because if she said anything, you should tell me, like, word for word. I think you should go for it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I mean, you only live once, so... Oh, all right. I see where your head's at. Now, who's ready to have their minds blown? If you don't mean that literally, I am... Me, me, me. Oh, wait. Actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those look like brownies. Brownie Town. No, never mind that. Magic? What does that mean? It means they're enhanced with certain qualities. Hmm. Well, maybe just don't eat too much. No promises. Gosh, Ren smokes. Mm. He eats weed no, brownies. Oh okay, my so gosh. See these little piles of rocks? The kids before us always leave them here, so you know where to try and tune in the signals. So you're going to want to stand basically right around here. And just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. Okay. So we're gonna stand How will we by know here. When it's You'll know. Trust me. Should be off now. Great, but um, don't take <laughs> don't offense if I want to throw a stick at it first. Trapped on Horror Island. Horror Island? It sounds a little different than what we're uh, on. Uh, no, just forget it. Uh, I 
think we should take out our radio thing. Hmm, how do I turn these on? Okay. supposed to do okay can I like can I like get up here like on top of this to get a better connection perhaps what the frick am I supposed to do Get it. I think I'm supposed to use the radio and do something with it, but I don't understand what I'm supposed to do with it. Something with the phone? Make that red, like solid. Stop blinking. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. There's someone talking. Ugh! I hate games like this. The ones that you actually have to think I hate. Ugh. What am I trying to get the phone to work? I don't get it. I'm confused. I'm confused. I'm confused. I don't get it. I don't know what to do anymore. Do I just leave? Like, do I just leave? I suppose we're technically not stuck here. We can leave. I think I just leave. I think I go to the electric fence. Alright. Do, 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 do. We'll go to the electric fence, everyone. I'm gonna throw Jonas at the electric fence. I really wish you could turn down the music in this game. They don't even give you the option to turn it down. I wish there was no music. The constant music is actually like giving me a headache. I feel like this game would be more fun to play if it was more ASMR. Like footsteps and stuff like that. Alright. Let's go down to the electric fence.
All right, we're gonna go get Ren from the woods. Ren is in the woods. So, just curious, but um, what's your running theory? Well, wait, um, if you wanna go get Ren, this is the wrong way, I think. Oh! This is the way to go to Fort Milner and Clarissa. The woods are the opposite way. Oh, uh, I didn't know. Whoops! This isn't the way to the forest? No, no, this is Fort Milner, so this is just gonna go to Clarissa. Ah, oh, all right, thanks. Yeah, let's turn back. There's no way I'm saving Clarissa over Ren, even though Ren annoys me. All right, we're going to the woods. Uh, my eyes. I um didn't realize just how much woods there were. This is like a like a genuine forest. With like you wanna turn around? No, no, I'm just saying this is like it's pretty sprawling. That's all. This is like only the front door. Just wait. Yeah, I thought it was just gonna be a park or something. But I just wanna make sure, you know, that we know where we're going. We do know where yeah, we're- Yeah, of course. It's just over the <laughs> river and through the wood, like the song. Yeah, but in the song, the horse knew the way to carry the sleigh. Through the white and whatever snow, I think. What? Okay, we have a wall you to know, climb this down. this place really creepily reminds me of a park or woods, I guess, near where I used to live. It's really kind of felt just like this. It's weird. Oh, yeah? What was that one called? Peabody, I think. I'm trying to remember the sign, but like half the letters had fallen off, so it spelled pea pork. My dad was really happy to move here, you know? He said the schools were safer, less knifings per capita. I guess he never considered the danger of whatever's happening right now. But, you know, everything's got something. Do I go this way or that way? I'm guessing this way. But I could be wrong. Hmm. Hmm. Bridge stand. Let me look at my map. I think I'm supposed to maybe go the other way. We're right here. We have to get here to save run. Ren's here. So, oh, I, I probably should go this way, right? To get to Ren? I have to go all the way up to get to Ren? I'm so confused. I don't know a thing that's going on. But I think this game is meant to be confusing. Oops. Okay, we're getting closer. Okay, we're gonna keep left. Keep left. Gosh, I didn't know this was such a, such a hassle to get to Ren. So we need to go north a bit. We need to go north. Um, why is there a cable car here? Couldn't they have just made, like, just like a normal bridge with wood? Yeah, it's kind of neat, right? It's like going on a gondola ride. I don't know if I'd say it's neat. I think I need to go north. Less than welcoming. Or at least it doesn't look very inviting. Look, it's a little scary, but Ren needs us, so... Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. All right, well, let's just see if we gotta take the, um, conveyor thing that's been rotting here since the invention of ovens. Can I not go this way? I can't go this way. Okay, where? So we oh we do have to take the cable car. I don't want to. I don't want to die, dude. Some things in this game just confuse me. Oh, 
All right. I think we do go this way. Campground. I think this is the engine. It's not even warm. Yeah, no juice. It's not... Unless I'm doing something... Frick! It's not working. No power? I mean, I would think if it had power, these lights would be on. Frick! We gotta find out how to turn the power on. Frickin' frack. Frick! Wait, what's... What goes up here? Okay, so we need to find power. We need to find power. Power transfer station 167. Hey, just what we need. Oh! Okay, that's a little strange. Why wouldn't they lock it? I mean, somebody should have locked it. Maybe the... I found the circuit breaker. Maybe. Or he's dead. Do not attempt restart without supervision. Um, Jonas. So I'm just saying, maybe he's dead. I'll be fine. Just say what I need to do. Just let me do it. That way, if something bad happens, you know. Please, I can handle pulling two switches. I really just don't like... I can't think of a way to delicately put this, but... Fine, okay? Take the reins if Whatever. you're Whatever. So just quickly Thank frickin' you. do it. All right. I want to get um, out of here. Why'd the lights go out? Mm. Which flip did you hit? The only one. There's only one switch. I should have done it. Power or whatever. I don't know why it didn't do what it should have. The lamp's flickering. Do you think it's like on backup power now or something? We might have just broken it. Ever think of that? I did think of that, but it's not like it's our fault the door slammed shut, so I don't know. For some reason, it reminds me of the cave. Let's just try to get the power on, all right? Everything about this is making my skin crawl. So I have to fix your freaking mess? No. Uh, any ideas? The, uh, light kind of reminds me of that triangle thing. I don't know why. Maybe it's a transmission or something. Whoops. Other than that, I don't know. Hop up and down and cry about our bad luck. What the heck? Maybe I'm not supposed to do this. All right, let's just exit. I guess we have to find another th way it's to do this. I can't believe this. It's locked now. <gasps> it's okay. We'll just What? There's got to be a way to turn the power on still. What the frick? Okay. Here we go. I'm doing it. Did I do it? That's... That's... God, I haven't heard this in forever. This is something my mom used to... <laughs> I am so tired of this funhouse bullcrap. I'm tired of all this bullcrap. I gotta get out of here. Okay, is it safe to say the power's back on now? Can we move on? Uh, was that there before? I don't think so. <sighs> uh, 
Alex, are you all right? Alex! <laughs> Not funny. Not funny. Opposite. Total opposite of funny. It was worth it. That's something I would do. <sighs> what a night, huh? <sighs> what a night. Um, what does that mean? What do you mean, what does it mean? I'm just saying, this- Humming like a barracuda. Barracudas don't hum. Says you, ma'am. Praise Hello. the Lord. Let's go. Go to the campground. I think we're almost to Ren now. We're almost. We're just a hop and a skip away. Just a hop and a skip. Okay. <sighs> well, when you look at that, it didn't collapse. That's one good thing that happened tonight. Yep. Yay. Okay, Ren is up here. We're almost to Ren. You used to come here a lot as a kid, right? To the island. I mean, I mean that's what Ren made it sound like. Yeah. Well, I don't know about a lot, but a few times. Yeah, I can see this place being cool, like in the summer, or even in the spring. You got the park, you got the main street shops. Yeah, well, I'm over it. Starting now. Some people camp here, but it's weird. I, I don't know why they just leave their tent. Looks kind of dumpy. Like, I don't know, like it's been abandoned. Yeah, they were saying how it was strange that there was no other people around. Have people disappeared except for them? Like, what's happening? You used to come here a lot as a kid, right? To the islands. I mean, I mean, that's what Ren made it sound you, Didn't you already say that? Did I? Okay, yeah, tonight's like being trapped in a nightmare zoo. But I don't know. You have memories here, right? What? Jumping off the diving board with little Janie and eating ice cream with little Franklin. Stringing. Cr <laughs> I never did any of that. All I'm saying is before tonight, this was a pretty cool place. And you did stuff here, and it's a part of you, you know? It's a part of you. And I just wouldn't want our first night out to, you know, wreck all of that for like forever. I just wouldn't want that. I th uh, fine. I won't hold it against the island. Whatever. I won't be wait. Wasn't this? <sighs> we passed this a minute ago, right? And it wasn't burning. I am um, honestly don't remember. How doesn't he remember? It's gonna happen again, isn't it? You used to come here a lot as a kid, right? To the island. I mean, I mean, that's what Ren... Something is... Something's wrong. We've already done this, like, twice. Done what? Because I don't remember any of this. We're... I think we're going in circles. A soccer ball! We've damn trees, like, I don't know how many times now. This is, uh, new. It kind of stinks. Yeah, it smells like it's been sitting in a diaper for a month. It's gonna happen again, isn't it? You used to... Wait. Haven't we done this before? We're going in circles or something. Oh, now you're getting it. Only took 300 go-rounds on the never-ending cycle of whatever we're stuck in. Well, sorry. I mean, wait, really? I don't remember that, but okay. <sighs> Oh, the ball, um, moved? That was weird. The ball's moving. Um. Who's there? So, it's just... <gasps> Why do I feel like I'm being That's mocked now? That's strange. What is this? Is it like aliens or something? What's happening? Whatever it is, I don't like it. I'm taking a picture of the ball moving, not your kicking, just so you know. <gasps> Alright, who are you? Alright, who are you? Maybe don't antagonize whoever. Okay. 
Do I whip out my radio? Someone's crying. Ah, oh, not again. Not again. This is so weird. I'm putting, I'm putting this away. I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to do about any of this. Is there something I have to do on my end? Am I supposed to kick the ball? I think they have a sense of humor. Oh, what's that? Don't want to play anymore? <laughs> oh my god. Alex. Ugh, my what? My not going to be happy with my blood pressure this year. Yeah, mine neither. Alex, <gasps> I think it's like a demon we're dealing with ghosts. Just a hunch. Maybe. What else could it be? I mean, really. Jonas! Jonas, I'm a where where uh, are you? I'm alone? They took Jonas? What? Whoa, wait, what what's happening? Don't tell Michael what to do about Clarissa, okay? Wh what do you mean? Wait, wait, we've done this before. Okay, uh, there's got to be a way out, or... <sighs> It's all right. We must have just missed, um, something. What? I, um, it was weird. You were gone for a minute. I did this, <gasps> I did the repeat thing again. And What's this? And my reflection talked to me. Huh. This is, it's just like the armoire in the cave. Super duper old, but in like new condition. <gasps> you know, I didn't realize I felt like a pressure in my head until right now. Maybe doing that fixed the loop. Can you guys see the demon on the you wall? Did helped something, I think. Uh, feel any better? Maybe. Remember all the times we trekked through here now? No, not really. I mean, I remember the ball thing, but that. I guess that didn't just happen, right? I don't know. I feel like I just woke up from a dream. Everything's so vague. Let's just keep going and get Ren. This is really insane, Jonas. Like, the craziest thing that's happening to anyone right now is happening to us. <sighs> True, but... But... Nah, I couldn't think of anything to say. What do you think they want? The, um... The ghosts. I don't know. I just hope they want to, like, play soccer every once in a while, and that's it. Wait, I can't go this way? Oh. <laughs> I remember this. The two Jacks carved their... Uh, Jack Mitchell and Jack Ladd, they used to hang out together I have to the go time. this way. And they carved their names into this bench on a school. How do I once. get there? You don't care, do you? No, please, keep going. <sighs> Forget it. Okay, so I go this way. Is that Nona? <gasps> Nona? Why is she here? D -d -d don't, don't, okay? Just don't move, okay? Don't come anywhere near me. Nona. Just don't. Nona, move. come on. It's us. You can see it's us. It's me and Jonas. This night has turned banana bread really fast. And I'm seeing things and forgetting things 
And I bumped in. Don't come near me. Come on, Alex. Just back away. Nona, it's me, Alex. Remember? Nona, we haven't run into you all night. This is the first time. Maybe not you, but it was an Alex and a Jonas. What are you talking about? Back at the beach? I'm talking about the Alex I saw at the pier. After the cave looked like a freaking 4th of July and I lost track of everybody. Nona, believe me, that wasn't us. I don't know that yet. So, just look. You're not gonna talk about my grandfather. You're just gonna stand there, politely, and tell me if you've seen Clarissa. Cuz I've been looking. We're here cuz we think Ren is somewhere in the woods. Have you seen him? No, not Ren. Okay, well... Hey, listen, Nona. You should come with us. That way we're not all, you know, separated. I'm not going anywhere with you. All right, okay, hey, I get it, I do. I'm jumpy right now. Just let her go, Jonas. She's a space monkey, right? We don't now. need her. Just... Nona, can you do me a favor? Can you just, can you go to the comm tower and wait for us? We got the lights on there, and it seems pretty safe. No, Nona, you should really come with us. It's better to stick together. Better for who? Nona, come on. For you. Who do you think I'm talking about? No. <sighs> Wait, why is and she like this? Is... Where? It's the cloud buster at the edge of town. Can't miss it. All right. Bye. Bye. Bye, Nona. Wait, how did she escape that fast? Come on. We're only a few steps behind her and she's already gone. All right. I think this is where Ren is. This is where Ren is. There's like a face here. There's like little demons. All right. All right, now... Hey, just for me, why'd you let me flip the switch back at the bridge? To be honest, I expected you to just pull ahead and do it yourself. As you wanted to, that's why. It's pretty simple, really. All right. Okay, that must be the way station. And actually, help me understand, why would an island need anything like that anyway? Like, nobody's going anywhere. Doesn't the whole thing just go in... Um, this was a, a mining island before the war. And the land, you know, as you can tell, it wasn't really conducive to most different ways of transport, so they dug into the hills and laid down tracks and carted the coal by freight to the, um, the pier for the boats. Can I ask you something? Uh, yeah? You think I'm kind of a slacker idiot, right? Like, I wouldn't find any of this stuff interesting? Jonas, I think you're smart. Come on, what are you talking about? Okay, so yeah, Ren is here. Hmm, I don't know. I just sometimes get these, like, whiffs of... I don't know. I can't think of the word for it. Maybe it's stress? Like, from what's going on right now? Oh man, thank God. I thought you were a werewolf. Why would we be a werewolf? I've convinced myself... <sighs> Good to see you're okay. It's bad out there. No, I'm good. I'm just glad you're here. Do you have, like, any idea what's going on? Okay, that must be the way station. And actually, help me understand, why would an island need anything like that anyway? Ugh, Jonas, we're repeating the same stuff again. We are? Oh, it's kind of weird that you can tell when it's happening and I can't, right? I mean, it's not like... I mean, I'm glad someone can tell, but it's just, there's your boy. Hey, Ren! We made it, finally. Um, Ren? Is there something wrong with him? Ren! Seriously, Ren, you can have a drug freak out on your own time. I don't have the patience to worry about you right now, so come on, look alive here. What's he doing? Is he, like, sleepwalking? I don't know how Ren? he, like, fell asleep Ren during there. all this. Come on, pal. The neighbors are here and they want to borrow some sugar. This isn't a guy on drugs. Not 
that I want to, like, alarm you. Ren! Hmm. I hope you have a plan B. Okay. I don't know if you remember, but the last time we got stuck, we used one of these things to get out of it, so I'm not just messing around right now. Yeah, I remember, I remember. Kind of. How much do I have to do it? Can Jonas go do the other one? Spin it too fast or too slow. Hey, where'd Ren go? He was hmm. standing right Ren, there. Are you still here? He's probably in this building, maybe? No! Ren must have used this to call us. Oh, it looks smashed. Um... Crap. I don't... Maybe we shouldn't, um, go near him? Ren, can you... Can you hear me? I mean, I know they say don't move somebody with a spine injury, but it's like, we gotta do something, right? Well, I'm not leaving him, so that's not even an option. No, obviously. Unless we got, like, really, really scared, then, you know. Ren, are, are you... Oh, God. Talk through, child. Feels. Stretched. Better. No. Jonas, where did you... We are abounding. Not one. one. Silly. But do not be stood. You are dolls. Would never... Plot. Hurt. Keep you. Can't. Won't. Hurt. You. Can you help us? We're... We're stuck here and... We just want to go home. Home. Kamina. We will go home. All of us. Leave. Possible. Uh, maybe? But I, I don't really... Grounded by Adler. So, uh, Margaret. Pretty little poppy. We don't. We don't know what you want. If you could just, just tell us, what do you want us to do? They're aliens. You stay close. Don't leave yet. Sit still. Bear fruit. Tag. Yeah. Ah! Ah! Holy mother! 
look on. You guys? God, Ren. Man. You're alive? I am? I am! Well, why was that a question at first? Why? Why is this... Why? Actually, thanks for coming, by the way. Sure. Why is this happening? I mean, I've been here. I visited this place like 15 times. The island's haunted, Ren. Like haunted with memories or elevators on their period haunted? The second one. Guys, anyone? Is this thing working? If Don't anyone can hear this, out there, in a whatever, I, I'm at the con tower on Edwards Island. Hey, she listened to us. Great. So, if anyone can... What is this? I I'm trying to communicate with the... Does she know how to even work that stuff? Doesn't sound like it. <sighs> we should get back there before she freaks out and runs away again. So... Are we going back to the comm tower for Nona, or... Uh, we should round up Clarissa at Fort Milner first. Look, we'll split up. You guys do that. No! And I can go tend to the lovely damsel distressed in the old tower. I wish you wouldn't put it that way, but... Can you even make it there? Can I even make it there? Well, you did just have a specter wearing you like a suit. And all that's left is little indigestion. I'll be fine. All right. Well, guess we're going that away, so... We'll see you at the comm tower. Hopefully with Clarissa. I believe in you! <laughs> right back at you. Milner Ho. Milner Ho. The journey continues. So, all right. So either way, you were gonna save both Ren and Clarissa, okay? But it just so happens that we saved Ren first. So now we're gonna go save Clarissa. So she's just a hop and a skip over this bridge. All right, let's go find Clarissa. Even though I really don't like her, she's kind of rude. I don't like her. Okay, I believe we probably just go this way. Maybe. Maybe over this little staircase. And then wait, and then Ren is going to the clock tower. So, or not the clock tower, the comm tower. So this is where Nona is and Ren's gonna go there. So we're not gonna be that far from there, okay. Wait, is he following us? This game's very interesting. I just don't really understand it. I think it, there's like aliens or something. Okay, so now we're here. We have to keep going right. Uh, what is that? Can anyone hear me? Anybody? Clarissa. Damn it, is, is this thing working? If anybody can hear me, I'm at Fort Milner in the, uh, I think, crap, I think in the gym or something. Well, she's around here somewhere. I was worried, honestly, that she um, might have left. She sounded sort of scared. Like in dire straits of actual trouble right now scared? Look, I think we can all be included in whatever definition of trouble there is, so... Okay, I think that door's locked. When I just... said something about Fort Milner being decommissioned, right? But, and hear me out, what if it isn't? What if they just said it was decommissioned and there's like still people like in there like doing stuff i think if they had alien autopsies or whatever you're suggesting is happening in there we'd have been taken out by snipers about 50 paces back maybe but listen like what if just what if all the stuff that's like happened to us the stuff we've been seeing is like the direct result of some shut up secret project it's like it's not locked there's like something blocking it clarissa she wouldn't have barricaded herself inside, right? What do you think? Keep looking? I think we should keep looking. You're probably right. We're not, no, it says Clarissa's all the way down here. So I think we keep going. I don't think she's in there. I do not think she's in there. According to the map. We can climb that ladder. Facilities Milner Outpost. 
Okay. Let's climb this ladder. This blinking red light up here. I think we have to use that radio. Yes. We have to use the radio. Dinner time. It's never too late to make dessert. Not anymore. <laughs> what the hell is this? Do you want to play a game? <gasps> the door. All right, I know the answer is no, but we kind of do have to find Clarissa, so let's just ignore the question and thank the weird... Sure. All right. All right, I guess we go through this creepy door. Go to the facilities. I don't want to rescue Clarissa. She's just going to stab us in the back. I just know it. She's a backstabber. Okay, she's in here. Oh, no, 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 no. You're fine. Don't be locked. Come on. Well, we didn't really need to go back anyway, right? Unless there's no way out, then yes, we might have. Well, Clarissa got in through some other door, so we should be fine, hypothetically speaking. Uh, speaking of which, she dated Michael? Is that right? <sighs> yes, quite annoyingly. I mean, was he the type of guy that would go for that sort of thing? I'm just trying to... No, not at all. I mean, he he was always so busy with school and like he was like always dating somebody, but it, it would never last long. In the daytime, this is pretty much skater mecca. I can tell. But what do you think Mike saw in Clarissa, really? Other than, I guess, the obvious. It's not a trick question, Jonas. She's been the homecoming queen. Hey, that's <gasps> What? Clarissa, hold up. <gasps> Jonas just left me. Why? Jonas, what happened? Are, are you all right? Jonas? Jonas, let me in. I'm not in the mood. I think it's safe to say I'm not going to be able to get in that door. I'm going to have to go up. <gasps> what was that? There's like some dude with laser eyes. Testing, testing. Um, okay. I can't... I, I can't hear anything outside at all, but luckily this radio thing's working. Look, whatever. Clarissa's not in here, and it's just a room, so, like, riddle me that, first of all, and then, second of all, I can't get out. The door opened, like, a second ago. Can't you... Are you sure you're just not turning the knob the right way, or... <gasps> Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. Don't let Jonas talk to his mom. It's not good for him. H how is this possible? W what's going on? Ow. I'm okay. Is it open now? <gasps> okay, what just happened I don't that, know that sucked are you okay a little shaken up well we blew past nap time a while ago but yeah I'm actually better than fine is this what you were talking to me on yep old girl did the trick you think maybe uh, Clarissa was using this before you know yeah. the palace and everything yeah lines up I guess but she's still been transmitting so she must still be in here somewhere oh here's a padlock code Three, four, eighteen. It's on a list of... Huh. They call codes cookies. Is that slang or something? I don't know, but we got the combo. So, great. Hey, did I... Did, did you see that? In... In the mirror? The reflection... Was weird. Uh, don't think I'm nuts or anything, but... My reflection kind of gave me, like, fatherly advice that... 
it seems all right now. I don't know. Maybe it wasn't anything. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. All right. Do I go down? I think we go down now. I don't think there's anything else upstairs for us. Uh, let's try going this way. There's a door. The Three, padlock. Four, eighteen, and voila. Set. I don't know. Okay, just. I think we're just gonna go. There's creepy things happening. We're just gonna keep going towards the creepy things. Okay. This is what we saw. It's like a shadow with like glaring laser eyes. It's so weird. Oh, gonna hate to go out in that. So actually, um, before we press on, I've had to go pee for like a while now. So since we're stuck anyway, I thought I'd- Oh my God, go in the corner then. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I know this is like way too much too soon for us right now, but I'm gonna totally explode. <laughs> My god, this guy. Alright, so does it say, it says Clarissa, it doesn't say Clarissa's here. It doesn't say Clarissa's here. Can I jump out the window? Yes, I can. Let me go down. Clarissa! <gasps> Clarissa! Okay, that was definitely her. What is she? Is this just like a game to her or something? She knows it's us. I don't think she'd be freaking out like this if she wasn't, like, in trouble or something. You know, it just occurred to me she could also be having, like, a Ren episode. A Renisode. Possessed or. Shut up! We want to call it. <sighs> nah, Clarissa's just being Clarissa. Making everything hard. The handprints are a macabre touch. Do you know who did that? Please tell me it's like a known thing teenagers here do or something. <sighs> Clarissa! I'm worried. Something must be really wrong. Clarissa's a lot of things, mm. but she wouldn't do whatever this is. We radio can't leave until time! She shows us where that radio is. I know it's annoying, but it's our only hope for getting us out of here so far.
What? I... that was... not fun. Just take it slow and easy. You've just had... an experience. Yes. Yes. Very good. This has been United News, and thank you for listening. Okay. This is just unbelievable. Anyone? Can anyone just... That's gotta be Clarissa. Let's get her and get out of here. Or use her radio and get out of here, but let's just get out of here. Door! Yay! I didn't like playing Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Clarissa's Grader. asleep right now. Be still so as not to wake her. Um... Huh? Larissa's asleep. Cross your fingers. Ugh, Clarissa. Oh, well, look at this. The super twins decided to grace me with their presence. Shut up. I thought maybe I wasn't good enough for a house call, doctor. So are we. Uh, okay, don't even start, Clarissa. We came. We're here. Be happy. All right, don't get all, you know, but be honest. Did you come because I needed help, or did you come because there was a radio? Um, Clarissa. I want to hear it from Alex. Yes, of course, Clarissa. I really don't appreciate the question. Okay. Speaking of the radio, where is it? I don't know. I can't get it to do anything I want. Alex, want to take a look at this? I suppose. Yeah, no, this is... This is like a low-frequency thing. It, it's just meant for the base. It won't... I don't think it can beam out. <sighs> Really? No, 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 isn't there a radio? Any officers who know your problems for and well will give you a friendly and sympathetic hearing. Who is that? Cross your fingers. Ah! Ah, uh, not now. We're, we're looping again. Crap. Well, just keep me in the loop. Clarissa! Is there anything like, can we cut her down with something? Cross your fingers. <sighs> Holy Ah, Clarissa? I would have swore she was in here. Clarissa? <sighs> oh, maybe this was the, the thing, the radio she was using. Clarissa? Clarissa, it's us. It's Alex. Are you okay? She's like hanging out the window. <gasps> oh my god! What Why would the... she do that? What? Why would she do that? We're, we're, we're not in. It's not like we're. She. She was. She was like possessed. What I, the I heck? Just, I, I just. Uh, this is. Jonas, this is so horrible. I don't. I don't even know what to. We. We should get to the others. I, I can't even imagine telling them. Or. Or how to tell them. I'm just... telling them. I just want to. We have to round them up before anything else. Before anything like this. Like, I don't need. I don't. Wow. Um, She's there's gone. There's no way she got up from that, right? Like, there's no way. We both saw. Oh my. Oh, thank Christ. She's alive. Maybe she just. Maybe she just twisted her. Twisted something. Or... Alex. Even if she fell feet first, she would have broken every bone in her body. How'd she just get up and walk away? This isn't possible, because unless she's built of rubber... Let's just put a pin in ghosts and say, until evidence proves otherwise. Is she still here, or do we just leave and go news? to our friends? Know what I'm saying? Yep. I don't think she's still here, right? Um, our friends are at Milner Outposts. I think we'll go to Milner Outposts and tell our friends, because I don't think she's still here. I think she's long gone. Outpost. We gotta go break the news to everybody. <sighs> Let's just get back to Ren at the comm tower. Maybe he's had better luck than us at anything. 
Okay, go back to the comm tower. We're at Milner Outpost. We gotta go down here. Do I have to... Oh yeah, I can go down. I don't have to go all the way around again. Okay. We're gonna go down? M. Epiphany Field? No, I don't think we want to go there. I think we want to go down and like diagonal. I think we want to go like not here. Maybe we do go that way. I just want to make sure we're not going the wrong way. So this way takes you where? Milner facilities. Oh yes, this is the way that we went before. We don't want to go back that way. So we do want to go this way. All right. This is so crazy. I need I feel like I need to pay attention to the details more because when they were asking me those questions during that hangman, I had none of the answers. I need to be paying more attention. I need to pay more attention. Ay ay ay. I hope I'm there already. That'd be nice. <laughs> What? So we have to go up to the left a little bit? Okay. Mayday! May! Oh, crap. This is it. Ren, this is just coming out of the speakers on the roof thing. It's not... Harden Tower! Oh, my god, is this what I sound like? Harden Tower, here we come! Alright, we gotta tell them what happened to Clarissa. Break the sad, unfortunate hey, news. Hey, I, I saw you guys coming up from the tower. The Dick Tower. I think you mean Harden Tower. Please don't ruin that for me. It's all I have left. Anything uh, good to report? Besides that you're still alive, which I'm glad. You know, don't get me wrong. Thanks. Um, yes, I am still alive. But, uh, no. Other than that, no. Any luck contacting somebody? Nope. No luck to speak of. And honestly, I thought this week was going to be a big karma dump. I found like 50 bucks in the street, and well, I Well, we're all here now. Well, I mean, except Clarissa, but we're mostly all here, and we'll come up with something. I hope so. The stupid radio has been what my therapist would call a negative reinforcer. Just won't work right. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. What? It's kind of, you know, it's just about to start doing its thing. Wait, second brownie? Run. Please tell me this is a joke, okay? This is a joke, right? He keeps eating his weed brownies. Why would this be a joke? I'm not joking. Wait, you're not messing with us? You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, all right? It's just to level me out. It'll, it'll bring me back up. That's what it does. If you're down, it brings you, you up. You better pray to whatever God scares you the most. It does this level thing you doesn't out. Because if this screws not us up, anything. you're on summary I'm probation. I'm getting something, but it's like, I don't know. What won't work? The, uh, radio? It, like, works, but... Uh, sorry, I was, like, weird earlier. But, hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. You've been, like, out there. Uh, Look, yeah. we tuned into something in the cave, and it was like Gabriel sounded the trumpet. Just everything went terrible. And, uh, ghosts. Yes, oh, oh, I got it. This is great. This is perfect. I know exactly what to do. Do you? Yeah, totally. It's Maggie Adler. Maggie Adler? Yeah, she has a boat. Had a boat. I mean, the boat's still here, but she's not. She's dead. Ren, what? You could have mentioned this at any point. I mean, we walked right past it. I know. It. I'm sorry. But I've been, like, stewing in my own panic here for the last couple hours. My sister, Allie, worked at the parks office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, no, gonna... no, we are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. Hey, come on. I'm not a Burnout. Okay, Well, so... and I'm not saying it's the best plan, but what other plan is there really, Jonas? Oh, I don't know. Yeah. Fix the radio, find Clarissa, set fire to the mug shop, and these are just off the top of my head. Yeah, I'm still worried about Clarissa. We don't know where Clarissa is. I'm not saying literally do that. I'm just... There's other things we can do. <laughs> but there isn't. 
Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want us to trust you when things are really bad? You had Alex bring the radio. You brought us He here. ran into the Come cave! On, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly not ours. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a productive. It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. I mean, we all grew up with each other. Alex knows she can- Guys, you know there's no television cameras here, right? Take the energy down a notch. Alex, I am not putting my life in his hands. This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Jonas. The stories I heard about this guy, he's a maniac, okay? He's gonna trash our only legitimate means of getting out of here if you buy into this crap. Legitimate means- I want to be neutral! You, you have no idea- Guys, stop it! Stop! The collective neuroses call a truce, okay? Yes, please. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house. And the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine mm. by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, not that yeah, you... Yeah, it's not like, you know... I'll do it! I'm fine. Whatever, I'm ready. Fine! She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my, like, no. brilliant idea or whatever. Please, Kidding, no. Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. You, uh... Just shut up, both of you. Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to shut depend up, on Shut up, boys. The night, yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of. Keeping in mind who's taller. Who do you want coming with you? No, no. Wanna come with me? Girl what? power! I mean... We don't I need no it. men! Why this are you isn't... making me shack up with it's this guy? Be quiet. Both of you. God, you're like... Puppies, you're not gonna die if I go to the grocery store for ten minutes. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this no, is it's fine. This will be a good. If you don't want to take sides, don't take sides. But no, nobody's. Come happy on, no, no. Let's get away from these men. Uh. Hey, Nona's happy. You're happy, right? Um, sure. All right. So our next task is to find the gate key. So we have to go back into town. Um, we're going, we chose to go with Nona. Because girl power, I'm sick of these guys fighting. This will be a good bonding opportunity for them to stay at the calm, the calm tower together. God. He's like smoking. You know, they're perfect for each other. One's smoking, one ate two weed brownies. They're perfect for each other. I'm gonna take my girl and we're gonna head out. God. We have to climb all the way down. Climb down. Okay. How, how exactly do we get to town? Okay, we're here. Uh, we're here. Okay, we have to go this way. And then down. This way, across, down. Okay. Alright. Come on! Let's go, Nona. We got important things to do, unlike the boys. We're gonna carry the whole squad on our back. Cause you know, we're girls and that's what we do. The boys can stay there and fight, we'll go do the dirty work. All right. Let's go to the fields and then from here, I'm not really sure where to go. This whole map kind of confuses me a little bit. Do, 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 do. You know, I do remember you from Mr. Tuttle's class. You sit in the, uh, back, behind Jake. I just forgot. I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, hey, it's, it's nothing to be sorry about. I don't talk all that much, so I don't know why you remember me. I'm also just, like, never there. It's a loophole where, I don't know if you know this, but if you ditch, 
you get a detention, and if you don't go to that, you get suspended. But mm. suspensions are like paid vacation. You can just do your work over. Um, so... We can go... Oh, we just go down across that bridge. So... Ah, nice. Good tip. Thanks, I'm gonna use that. Yeah, of course. Oh, and don't tell anyone, but my birthday's in three days, and I'm having a thing, and you're invited. I think Chris <gasps> is out of town, so... I'm invited! No well, happy early birthday! In my family, we celebrate birthdays all week, so you're four days late. I gotta get in the mind state. Thanks. I'm sorry. I don't even know why I brought it up. That's not true. What's I'm this? About, uh, well, I'm worried about Clarissa and... Well, I was thinking about my last birthday when... Mm. Um, actually, sorry. Never mind. This has nothing to do with anything. I'm just in a fog right now. No, come on. I want to hear this. It was last year, your birthday. Go. Just this was when Nicole was in a car accident and... Where are we? So, of course, we cancel and go visit her, and I'm not going to pout about that. It's common decency. It's fine. But afterwards, after this totally emotionally draining night, Clarissa still came over and surprised me with this huge cake. And we stayed up and watched all my favorite movies, and she didn't have to do that. But it was nice. Wait, Clarissa did that? That's actually pretty Clarissa. nice. Our Clarissa. She's a good person. Alex, really. It's just... It's like she's had a pebble in her boot for a while that she just can't seem to get rid of. Anyways, my birthday's in three days, and I just hope she's okay. That's all. We'll find her, Nona. We're not leaving without her. Ugh. Yeah, I know. Although she could possibly... Well, she's not dead because her dead body moved. Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. Discovery Cliffs is Discovery Cliffs Did I go too far? Oh, well, maybe this is where I go. Do I go to the cliffs? I'm lost. How do I get to the freaking town? Oh yes. We're going the right way. We've been here before. All right, we're looking for some type of key for some type of gate. Um, and it's like in the main town by like the shops, I think. So it's the parks and facilities building. That's down a bit, right? If I'm remembering the right building, I don't think it's far. Yeah. I just hope Ren's not misremembering his sister's job or something. Hmm. Interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty interested and invested in this. This is getting really good. Okay, one second, one second. I have to quickly text someone there. What building do we go in again? What building? The information Clarissa, center. What are you? How did she get up there? What are you doing? She's alive. You're, you're alive. Man, I've never been so happy to see you in my what life. What the heck? What? Alex. Christ, what's wrong with her? She's possessed. Clarissa, can you? Can you hear me? Alex, do you know what's happening? Is she? Is she going to be okay? Clarissa, wake up. Fight them off. Take control of yourself. Um, hang in there, baby. Alex, uh, please, can you just... I don't know what you can do, but can you just do something? Please, just try anything. Like, uh, Clarissa! I can... I know what to do! Try. Okay, I'll try. I know what Clarissa, to do! Can you? The radio! Can you hear me? Alex, 
Jackson, come on, just please try and get her down. At least, please, somehow. Triangle time. Come down. Uh, she just looks off. Let's go. One more. What? You think you can control me? Yeah. Clarissa. I'm I'm trying to help you. This is this way. Help me. Help me. How will that help me? I was looking forward to seeing you. Yes, I used to dream about something like this. It, it's helped the others. Ren and Nona, they've gone through the same. Gone through what? Their children have gone through nothing. When you're off, the little machine has no more heart than a brain. No more heart. <gasps> Is she okay? Or she's... I think so. Oh, Clarissa, are you okay? You scared the crap out of us. I'm fine. I can... I'm fine. Okay. Are you sure? Because that didn't look great. Do you remember anything that happened? I remember waiting in Fort Milner and seeing you. That was a while ago. How did I get here? You don't remember how you got here? Clarissa, you were dead a minute ago. Do you, do you realize that? You saw your body, no joke. Really? Okay, well, I'm alive now, so hallelujah. So you're just blank? No, I remember something. I remember you with that radio. And I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Wait, what? it's Clarissa's turn already? Yeah, it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's turn already? I haven't even asked one question. Everyone's asking me. I get to do the asking now. Oh, guys, okay, I know you think we're still playing truth or slap or whatever, but this isn't real, so... Well, wait. Clarissa hasn't gotten a chance to ask something yet, so... Yeah, and you, of all people, should know what my question is going to be, because I'm not going to waste it. Alex, what did you do? Explain why me and my best friend, and your idiot best friend, and your new stepbrother are all screwed. Clarissa, please don't draw a chalk line here. Don't make factions. Just, we have to stick together if we're going to make it through this. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be her fault. Of course it's her fault. There's no other way this story goes. She creates Don't listen to her, okay? She's pissed at the world, and she likes to take it out on me, and, and none of what's happening makes any sense anyway. I'm not. It's not no, a... No, come on, Clarissa. Let's not do this right You're now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God, the town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her freaking Clarissa... forehead. And the giant, lit-up Christmas tree reason why is that Michael is dead because of her. What? Because of her. Like, it would take a very sick person to see it that way, and I would love to hear the explanation. Michael was gonna leave town. He was free. He was out of here until this one convinced him to take her swimming for one last God knows what. How is that my fault? And he drowned. He drowned in Horn Lake while this one could barely flap her arms. Clarissa, uh, you were there. No one was there, so how the hell would you know? Everyone knows. Everyone knows the freak sister who let her brother die while she clung scared to the bowline. What? Okay. I'm sorry, but enough, Clarissa. That's enough. It's too much right now. I can't. I can't believe. Oh, she is. Seriously, Nona, it was awful. All right, it, it's still awful. And, and I. I don't. Just Alex. This is none of my business. Okay. Exactly. But we came here to do a thing, and that thing is going to get us home. So let's get home. No. Uh, Clarissa, what are you? All the elves in the free. Hey, whoa. Man, do you ever do you ever get deja vu? Jeez, I just got a serious thing of goosebumps. Yeah. Right oh, constantly. I'm like the empress of deja vu. It's kind of been my it's kind of been like the theme of the whole night, really. <laughs> oh, I didn't know. Okay. okay, well, the office that we gotta try to get into is like right there. So let's try and whatever our way in. All right, so we go in here. We're looking for like a key, I think. Yep, this isn't budging. Um, I don't know about that. I think, yeah, I think we can just bust our way through, honestly. <laughs> okay. The lock looks pretty worn. Bust our way through? What is that supposed to mean? I think we should try it. 
All right, let's do this thing. <laughs> Girls, get it done. Cross your fingers and hold your thumbs. Hey, know what kind of jet that is? Nope. Cool. Carry on. Uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket radio, mm. I think. But it's like there's way more stations on the dial. Ooh, neato. Here's another one. It says, they're wall radios? Wave assisted lock? Whatever that means. Oh, duh. It says right here that each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. So they're like ID tags or something. It must work for the gate to Adler's house, too. Oh, great. Let's hike it back to the gate. Ooh, wait. Wait, here's like a... Wait. What is this? Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Why would her stuff be here? Didn't her family or, like, hasn't her family been carting her things back to town? No, we can start back. I just want to... Okay, here. To... Um, steal a boat and leave. That's our next task. We found this pocket radio, and it's a special one because it has more stations on it, and supposedly we can use it to open the gate door. So we're going to go down there and try to get in the gate so we can steal a boat so we can leave the island. Whom it should concern, this island and its history is a lie. Jeez, she didn't have fond memories of this place, did she? What? What could that mean? I have been compelled by both forces outside of my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. But now I feel any further inaction may carry a far greater risk. Forces outside our control, like, like ghosts or the army or what was she talking hmm. about? Let me finish then. Inside you'll find two wall equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to the nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Find these beacons and the notes within, and discover the true chronicle of the island. Huh? Wh what the hell is she talking about? It's like if we use these new radios, we can tune into 140.1 and hear like instructions that will lead us to buried stuff. I don't know. To whosoever finds the material. Know that I'm discomfited in keeping it hidden and ashamed for the lies I help preserve. Huh. So if we tune into that station, we can get clues? Interesting. <laughs> Alex, why are you wearing that jacket? It's like... What? She's going to roast my jacket now? 75 degrees and the sun's out, you know? And I thought you said you were going to go swimming anyway. The sun is not <gasps> out. The sun is, I guess, it barely came 1 p.m. last year. See, this is when I get punished for watching the weatherman. He said it was going to be, like, overcast. He said there was a chance for clouds. Hey, Michael, we didn't bring drinks. Did we? I thought we said we'd bring drinks. Wait, Michael? Uh, yeah? What is it? Did I almost step on a crab or something? You're dead. I'm dead. I'm dead? I think she's talking about the- Oh, the, the car? No, they don't- Listen, Mom and Dad know. They don't care. Well, I mean, they cared a little, but they know I can fix a broken tail. No, 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 just listen to me. You will drown. Not here, but at Horn Lake, back at home. You seem really confident. She seems confident. I'm a little nervous. I would be. Relax, Alex. I'm going to teach you how to swim at the pool in the park. Don't worry about it. Where's... where's Jonas? Jonas? Who's Jonas? Is someone else coming? Yeah, is that a friend of yours? You want to know who Jonas is? He's my new stepbrother, okay? Do you... do you get what's happening now? <laughs> All right. Can you just call your new friend your best friend for my sake? Stepbrother's kind of encroaching on my territory there. Yeah, it's like when my mom calls her cat her special little lady. It's like, I'm standing right here. Today turned out to be a flawless day. It really did. Yeah, no, it did. It really did. I wanted to bring a kite, but thought you'd laugh at me. Clarissa, doesn't this... Don't you remember... We're all on the island. Nona's there. 
I love Nona like a three-legged puppy, but she would shrivel up and die in the sun. Oh, yeah? Yeah, she's better off at home, trust me. All right, let's go to the beach. Let's go to the beach. I'm so confused. Is this like... So this is a flashback, but yet Alex is aware of what happens. It's been a spell since we did something, right? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. How have you been? What's been going on? How's classes? How's... What's his face? Mr. Collins' English. Truthfully, I... Um, I... Ah, sorry. I think... Yeah, I... <laughs> I accidentally left my phone on the ferry, because I do things like that. <laughs> oh, God, you idiot. Go get it before it leaves. When I get back, I want to hear an Alex story. <laughs> well, can't I just come with you? I'll take two seconds. Think of something to tell me. Am I supposed to, like, follow him? So... <laughs> Do you... Well, I guess you don't remember anything, right? What am I meant to remember? I'm sorry, did I forget something? Our whole, like, island horror show. Ghosts and possessions and... And none of this is jarring, like, anything loose. If this is about Ren's movie, I mean, I told him I didn't want to do it. Half the script was an underwear scene, so, you know, no thanks. Um, what? I'm glad we could all do stuff today. I'm glad you were cool with it, I mean. I know you guys are really close, and, like, I know it can be annoying when somebody starts keeping all their time for their girlfriend or whatever. So, I think it would be cool if we could, like, continue to do things together. Yeah, I, uh totally understand and yeah let's uh, do stuff you know cool cool michael uh he loves you like a lot i'm sure you know that but he talks about you all the time <laughs> oh alex did this and alex let the frogs out in science class isn't she hilarious yeah well i love him too I had to fight the skipper for it but he didn't reckon how many squats i could do what's it up to six only on burrito days. On non-burrito days, it's like eight. Ah, oh, Jesus, thank God you're back. It's like an eternity sitting here with this one. <laughs> Thanks a lot. No, I know what she's talking about. Hey, I'm interesting, I'm entertaining. <laughs> thank you. So, I actually really want a cold something, so I'm gonna run into town and get like a soda. Anybody want anything? Um... Uh, yeah, get me a drink too. Sure. I'll be back. Okay, I'm here. What's the story? I want the news. I want the Alex first edition. What's going on? I've missed you, man. I, I've just missed you a lot, that's all. Hey, come on. I've missed you, too. And I know I've been hanging out with Princess, but it's a two-way thing. You can knock on my door. We live in the same house. We gotta bring back movie night and board game night. <laughs> All the nights. Uh, no, Michael, I can't. You're... You're not there. Well, sometimes I'm there. And look, I know this was supposed to be our day, but I completely forgot I promised Clarissa I'd do something with her, so thanks for chaperoning. I know it's not what you had in mind, so... But I owe you. Yeah, no problem. Just don't get all smoochy-smooch while I'm in the general vicinity. <laughs> because that would ever happen. It's important to me that you like Clarissa, Alex, so... Tell me the truth. What do you really think of her? Um, do what you want. God, do what you want, man. Don't ask me for advice. <laughs> okay, I'm taking that as endorsement, just so you know. You know, I never noticed. That's a good looking jacket. I should ask for it back. I don't like my new one. It feels oh, like I got shoes it's on her, my arms or something. It's her brother's jacket. <sighs> you know what, Bucko? I need it more than you. <laughs> Bucko? You haven't called me that in years. No, I like our brother. Our brother is so nice. Why was he with Clarissa? Michael is so nice. It's so interesting. Alex, are you... All right, are you back with me now? Man, you've been acting like a... I don't even know how to put it, like a bird, just flitting around in circles for 10 minutes. I was about to, like, slap you or scream or something. Nona, I, I just saw... I think I just saw my brother Mike. What? How? Where? Here? Is he... Was it like a... I don't... I don't know what to call it. A vision? I was... It was like those time jumps we're sometimes having, right? This was... It's 
it's like we've been having ripples, and this was a wave. I was bumped all the way back to when Michael was still alive. Right now? So, I am supposed to go this way? Hmm, interesting. I think... Hey, okay. why aren't you at the tower? This one got a little antsy. Weird stuff was playing on the radio. That voice said I had a mother's laugh. What does that even mean? I guess the radio will open this somehow? Hopefully. Mm -hmm. Okay. Give it a whirl. But anyways, yes, we did it. We got the thing to open the gate. It's a new radio. We think that's how it works anyways. What was oh, it, cool. 140? Let's get out of here. Well, if the radio is not It doesn't matter without Lena, Marissa. Do India, I really have to point out Dolphin, that she's not here? Hotel, oh, yeah, that's Tango. true, I For suppose. For the ships coming home, turn on the Lima, India, Golf, Hotel, Tango. For the ships coming home, Look at how much more stations there are. How am I supposed to know which one it is? Turn on the Lima. Creepy music. There's so many numbers, how am I supposed to know? I have to go through all these numbers? All the way this way. <gasps> I got one. Let's go. Cool. All right. Wow. Neat. <sighs> Adler Estate. Let's go. We're gonna steal a boat and we're getting off this island. Crying out loud. <laughs> we need to get out of here. Okay. All right. Jesus, that house is huge. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the chateau. Ah, oh, she does have a boat. Boat. Yeah. See. Allie knew what she was talking about. She should, anyway. I mean, she had to schlep back and forth here all summer. So we're just gonna take the boat and dip? Well, I'm assuming there's gonna be stuff to hold us back, of course. We're gonna have to go in that oh. big house. Oh, it's like a- it's like a boat that needs keys. There are no oars. And oh, before duh. we crazy, it's not- It wasn't with Maggie's stuff back at the office, like with the radio? No. Sometimes we when I lock stuff, myself I out of my house, I'll just... I can't help but just stare at the deadbolt trying to, like, hypnotize it to open or something. You ever do that? Um, not really. But we can try that now if you think it'll help. Okay, I think we just go inside the house and find the key, right? It's a radio lock. The woman sure did love her antiquated security. Ooh, radio lock. Let's go! 
Oh. The gizmo. Okay. This is kind of scary. Not gonna lie, being in this Find house. Oh, God, Jesus. Scared me. Thought you were like Maggie Adler's dead body or something. Everyone, just keep your distance. What? Why? It's Clarissa. Yes, dear. Why? I'm as harmless as a June bug. Something's, something's wrong with you. I don't know what, but, but I don't know. It's like you're just not on our side. Not on your side? What? I, I yell at you a little bit, and suddenly I'm a Russian spy now. Stuff happened. It happens. It's fine. It was more than just yelling, okay? You were dropping atom bombs of rage on my head. Honey, you would know if I was truly upset, okay? Ask Nona. Scott Fisher is a limp for a reason. Look, Clarissa's here, so everyone's here now. We can just... everyone's okay, all right? That's a good yeah, thing. Yeah, let's just find the keys to the boat or a phone or whatever and just find a way home. I promise we can all keep talking and or... Clarissa, fight. you just better hope there's two boats or something because you're not sitting anywhere close to me. You better hope there's two boats for your giant ego if you think you can dictate the evacuation terms. Okay, haha. -ha. Enough jousting and reposting. Let's carry on. Now, everybody find something and hope that it helps. I don't trust her. I'm not gonna trust her. Ever. I don't trust her. I didn't trust her from the beginning. And I have good intuition! Oh, that's an attic? Thought it was like a cat's toy or something. Wanna come up? Yeah, sure. Let's go, attic! The chest is padlocked. Needs a combination. Mrs. Adler was either paranoid beyond belief or just a very tidy woman. Well, she buried information in sonically camouflaged containers, Jonas. My guess is paranoid. Alright, we have to find a padlock code somewhere, but we did find the little attic, which is nice. Wait, have you seen this? It's like a, a star map or a diagram of planets or something. Yeah, why would she mm. need anything like a map of the universe? I mean, it's not like she's bouncing stuff off satellites for a job. Or maybe they were back then. What do I know? Because oh, there's aliens! An amateur astronomer, probably. <laughs> what? Like she cared if you were a Scorpio or something? I thought that stuff was after her time. That's astrology, not astronomy. Oh, yeah. That fits the description better. There... There are aliens, and she knew about it. Oh, it's a it's a draft of her letter that she left in the office. To whom it should concern. She left notes everywhere, she said. Hidden with secret signals. She was an odd one, I'll give her that. But, you know, cool in a way. Maybe she was up to something, you ever think of that? I mean, she's wrapped up in this thing somehow. Well, maybe, but also things don't have to make sense. Sometimes stuff just happens, and that's the end of it. Okay. We have to keep looking. Um, There's a door down here I think that's open. Maybe we should head down there. <sighs> it's been disconnected. Bummer. Maybe we head to that door down there? Man, she owned enough books. It's mostly math, I think. Ergodic thermodynamics... And religion, sheesh, okay, there's a lot of- Okay, we get it. She liked the smell of paper. Fascinating insight. We'll all miss uh, her dearly. Put I'm not talking on. to you. I'm just talking out loud. <laughs> Remember that You guy? can only ever talk out parents? loud. Ugh. Your kid's better than- Oh, um, Chad's lake house. Yeah, yeah, that guy's They're just weirdo. waiting by the boat. Uh, yeah. They're not even helping. They both shouldn't get to come. They're just sitting by the boat waiting for us to bring the key so they can just hop on and relax. Whatever. All right, this door open. This is where we have to go. Okay, projector. There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. Never doubt me. And here's the combination for the... There's a, a padlock chest mm, Combination. The 29, 18, 54. Uh, cool? She made a lot of... What should I call these? Slides? They're not videos. Um, silent memories? Alright, I don't care. I'm gonna go figure out what's in the padlock chest. And I'm really mad that N Nona and Clarissa aren't doing squat diddly poop. 
They're just expecting to hop on the boat and do nothing. Look at them just chilling. Are you, um, doing okay? <sighs> yeah, I'm alright. Yeah? We're going home soon, so... Yeah, that's true. Alright, we have to go up to the attic again. Do you guys hear that? There's like a creepy tapping sound. 29, 18, 54. It's a lot of radios and... I think something is in this closet. Office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. We think that means she couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. Is this... Ah, the There's something keys. over there. Perfecto. What is Ren doing? All right, we got keys for the boat. Where? I got the keys. They were in the attic upstairs. In a chest, but who cares? Let's just go. Okay. <gasps> Alex. What? Oh, Alex. What? Come down here, please. That's Clarissa. I want to show you. I'm not. I'm not listening to this, all right? I'm not playing along anymore. Oh, just come down, and we'll drink to our future. <laughs> Ren, come on, we got a boat to catch, buddy. Uh-oh. What the heck is happening? Nona, come on, honey, it's time to motor. Oh my god. Uh... Come on, Jonas. I, I really need you. Don't blink out on me now. This door... The door is locked. Uh, ah, there you are. Uh, now we imagine you're a bit confused. But don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Training? Training? I don't want to be trained. Training. Well, you signed up for this, Alexandra. In the caverns, you tuned in to our signal. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. You walked in here with. I wish I hadn't tuned into that stupid thing. Okay? If I knew what it was gonna do, do you, do you really think I would have even brought this radio? It's okay. Everything will be fine. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house, and you will go and find it. See? As simple and good humor as, as your mother's apple pie. I don't want to play this. Just tell me what's happening. Refusal to cooperate will incur grim penalties, I'm afraid, but it's your choice. Now, let's start with the softball. I spy, with my little eye, radiation. There is, of course, a time limit here. So, ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Is it... are you talking about the TV? Very good. Well done. The older models emitted x-rays. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation in another sense. Pay attention. What does this have to do with, with us? I mean, we're, we're I not... I spy with my little eye a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Eight. Seven. What? Six. Five, what? Four, I didn't even hear what she said. Three, two. Uh, is it the, the this painting? It, it looks kind of like a knot. Excellent, excellent. You're doing so well. It's time for the bonus round now, so stay quick. This is what you really want to find. I spy with my little eye a picture of a memory. Be fast now. Five little ducks went the, the picture of, of, I guess it's Maggie Adler and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Anna. You see, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing, well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Anna tried to sport with us many years ago and, well, only one survived. And in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time. And a far-reaching tolerance for the ignorance. 
Wait, what? What happened to Anna? Let's leave it at the poor girl didn't know what she was playing with. It doesn't matter. They're not an eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use the waves to absorb into your friends so the sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. You, you can't do that. Think about what you're doing. We can do that, Alex. No! It seems your parents as 80 years has been for us eons to know an existence without life. We tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. We had to keep you here on the island. It will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. And on to the next. Please just don't do this. We're... We're not it's sad, I know, to lose the facility to feel, to be, but we have not felt anything for a very long time, and we'll do whatever is necessary. When our vessel dashed on the rocks, we had until dawn, and so are you. We would spend our time wisely, and we thank you for your good service. What the heck? Could have gone better. What the heck? So now I'm just alone? She took them all? I just have to be alone now? Can I leave? I can't leave? Just don't try and influence Michael. He can live his own life. Okay, seriously, who are you? Can I leave now? Oh. Okay, there's two more up here. Tape players. One more. So we can go on. <laughs> I, I think I'm gonna be sick. Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision. Oh, we're going on the boat? You and Clarissa standing what the heck? just now. Was it? Ugh. Oh, that was very, very real. We're in, like, trouble. Yeah. Yeah. God. We kind of really are. So, I mean, Christ. If Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then... I mean, the plane has to be to retrieve her, right? I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost is... Or we could just leave? What? Leave! Seriously? We can't just leave? Yeah, I mean, I know she can be like the girl equivalent oh, of... come on! The boat's right there! Remember the old plan? Take this gift of freedom and french fries? Nobody ever said Alex, that. Alex, no. We can't leave. Yes, Not we can. Well, if we're going to the cave... Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right, I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. What kind of name is a Fippany Fields, anyway? I don't Wait, want to find her. Is it a Fippany? It's, uh... It's a Piffany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. All right, well, let's go then. Let's go then, I suppose. We're just gonna leave the boat there. Do I have the option to like take the boat and dip? I wanna take the boat and dip. Boat. Oh, forget it. What's the point? We can't use it anyway. What? Oh, I should have said, wanna see if it'll start. I don't want people to hate me, but I wanna get out of here. I don't like it, it's creepy. Okay. We are... 
trying what are we where are we going it doesn't say where we're going it, we're going to the cave i forgot how to get to the cave oh like the cave from before oh by the beach the cave by the beach that's where we're going So the cave, we're going to the cave from the beginning, which is down here, I believe. Wait, I can't click it. We can't go down there? Wait, I think we have to go down there though. If we go this way? I don't know how to get there. Wait, what? I can't go anywhere? Where the frick am I supposed to go? It won't let me leave. What the frick, you have frack? can't go this way. Is my game bugged again? For some reason my game was bugged earlier. What the fuck? It's not letting me go that way. Do I have to do something quick? Like what the F doesn't want from me? Do I go in the basement? Like, there's nowhere else for me to go. Be careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh man, if this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos. Yeah. I'm sure this is just God, the it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will you? Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave, just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But won't it be, like, locked or something, right? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or hmm. whatever bomb shelters are made out of. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself? Mm. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's, that's going a little above, above and beyond. Well, how would she even know this? I don't care how much research she did, this would be out of anyone's realm of expertise. Well, something better work, or... Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, sorry. This is like... This looks like the end, but from the... From the wrong film thing. No, no, no. Wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing, because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See? Mm. It says, when someone sends an emergency signal from the catbird station in the woods... And the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. Okay, any other ideas? Preferably ones that aren't unnecessarily complicated and obtuse and hanging by the thinnest spiderweb thread of relevancy. All right, then. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Okay, use the response station to open bomb shelter. And then Ren and Nona 
are going to go into the cave. All right, we have to go up to the response station, which I think we've, we haven't been there before, but we've been close to there. We can do that, okay. All right, break. And if anything goes wrong, please don't tell me, I won't want to know. Well, now I'm gonna run over there and specifically tell you at the first drop of bad news. No. All right. So now we just have a long journey to get there, which is annoying. I hate walking places. I just want to get there. Okay. We're going to go up to the... I don't know what is next to this place. Epiphany Fields. Okay, we just have to go really far north, basically. Alright, I'm gonna go north. I'm assuming... What? Already? Are you freaking serious? Alex, Ren Alex, okay. is are you, drowning. Are you back to normal? I just saw it, it, it was like a premonition, I think. And, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that. Because I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay. Just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider than. But the thing with Ren, it was so real. It was like it. I. <laughs> no, look, it kind of. Oh, there's sense. Ren. Hey, guys. Uh. Wait. Did I get the plan wrong? Because if I got it right. No, you didn't get it wrong. You're supposed to be yellow brick roading it to the wood station right about now. I think Alex just wanted to make sure you guys were still kicking. We are fine. Well... Well, not fine. Okay. But okay. We're like orange on the color wheel of emotional stability. Sure. But seriously, let's split up. You have to do your part in the woods. Okay. We'll I thought I was going the right way. It's not that I was trying to find you, Ren. I literally didn't know what way to go, and that's just the way I picked. Oh my god, what is that? All right, we gotta go really far north. I'm assuming this is the way. All right, yeah, and then I think we go this way. Milner Outpost, I think that's the way. This is the way. Okay. Hmm. This game is very interesting. I'm very confused, but it's very interesting. Alright, Towny Grove. You know what time it is? 4 a.m. It's 4 in the morning. Which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually? In, uh that situation. Bad. Usually, I'm asleep at 11 with my hand half dunked in the chip bowl. You think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. It is all we have, yeah. I just, I just wish I felt like the ghosts were concerned that their plan won't work. I just feel like they're pretty confident. Like, they know by sunrise they're all gonna be shopping for school supplies. Jonas, they should be concerned. They should be scared. And that's on them if they're not. All right. Oh, J Jesus, what are you doing jumping across that? There's another, there's like another way down here. Relax. I can't believe not you even made it. Not as big a jump as it looks. You, uh, barely made it, but okay, uh, I guess. Jonas yeah. is gonna die. You know what? 
In a time of an emergency, we gotta get going. We gotta get there fast. Okay. Okay. Bridge stand. Okay, are we here? We are. So, use the response station to open bomb shelter. So, is this right here? That must be the response station. The station's up at the top of the hill. Okay. <sighs> I hope this works. Me too. Me too. We gotta climb. So, basically, we just keep going to the top. So, I think we go that way. Go this way. This way. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. No. God, oh, we're in another loop de loo. They always come at the most appropriate times, don't they? Yeah. Now the station's up Fuck. at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also hope that. Okay, I don't think it's gonna... I don't think it's gonna work. <laughs> I think we need to, like, go in here or something. Maybe? Maybe not. Maybe we just keep attempting. I don't know. Of course this is happening. What the freak, man? What the freak? Should I try going a different way, like this way? I can't go that way. Can I go this way? <gasps> Ren! Ren! I don't know what happened. Ren! Ren! Ren, he's... He had an accident. He... He died. I couldn't. I knew it! No, no, come on. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead. Because apparently killing yourself doesn't actually do anything here. Alex. Well, it's the truth, Jonas. And I'm not gonna stand here and fall for one of these I'm dead, no I'm not, shuffleboard swaps again. Come on, let's skip to the last chapter. I know it's gonna happen. He... he drowned. He took a fall. <gasps> what? But we just saw them. Know. He just... He just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. And done, in this case, is particularly... I know you're not Jonas, so there's no use in pretending. Soon it won't be a pretense. It'll be an absolute. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. And you should take- Closing the tear in the cave might work. Y you don't know that for sure. We do know that for sure. We've seen others try, we've seen you try. So pay attention. It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But, if you agree to let us take her, let her go, quietly, without fuss, you won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. Take Clarissa! We leave the rest of you cattle alone. Um, take her, then. You know, it's not often that we meet someone your age that's as mature as you are, Alex. You really understand things. Just, just leave, please. Very well. As you were, Alex. We've enjoyed engaging with you tonight. All right, thank you very much. Just take Clarissa. Where's Jonas? Where's the real Jonas? What the frick? Are you serious? I still can't go up there? I still can't go up there? Add 
Adler letter. She thinks that the ghosts were pushed out of our reality and maybe aren't actually dead? My belief, bolstered by Anna's and my research conducted largely at the Catbird Station where interruptions were rare, is what the men and women of the USS Kanoloa were separated from our dimensional existence by the uh, implosion of the submarine's nuclear reactor. I identified one passenger, Henry, by his call sign and his confused dick diction and real uh reliance on game logic says to me that their emotional states if not mental states had been reduced to that of children a thought i cling to when i envision anna's demise hmm. all right well we got a letter is that me up there who is that that's a person maybe i should go across the bridge All right, I'll go check out the bridge quick because I think there's a person up there. Hmm, tape players. Another one. How doesn't she see the person? No, no. Nah. Who's your best friend, Alex? I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just. No, no. How could you not know? You guys were. He wouldn't leave your side. How could you miss this? I don't know. It was. He was like there. He was right there with me, and I turned around, and it was as if he had just gone blank. Yeah. Right. The station's up at the top of the... Okay. Ugh. God, that was... My mouth feels like I just ate a tree. Listen, Jonas, I, I did something just now that you need to know. Um, I, I traded Clarissa to the ghosts, so they let the rest of us go. No, you didn't. Alex, how could... We had a plan. We had the... I mean, why are we going to the bomb shelter at all if you think that's not even going to work? It just, it seemed like the right thing to do, considering everything. But, I mean, do you think I wanted this? Of course I didn't. It was tough. How can we even trust them? They're going to say whatever they want to get what they want. So I just... What, what, what would you have done then, huh? Doom us all? We have no idea if any of this, this bomb shelter stuff is going to work, Jonas. I wouldn't have... I just wouldn't have done this, okay? I just hope you know... I'm not even gonna say what you're doing, because I just hope you know what you've given up here. Really. Man. Hello? Anyone there? What? Are they... Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... Right. Radio locked. There's I people in here? This thing is that. Okay, I just have to tune it. These ones are hard. Let's go in. Hello. We're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. Otherwise, stay on the line, and we'll send a traffic custodian out to you directly. Wait. Uh, hello. We're here. I think she's just stunned by your cavalier attitude to your I thought Ren was dead. If we don't hurry up with this thing. Okay. All right. Fine. I thought Ren was dead. All right. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. 
Great. Okay, we'll meet you there. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and now. Close the t the close the time hole and save the day. So Ren didn't die. That was just one of those time loops. So it wasn't actually real. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Basically just go back the way we came, I think. father by a few months and um, when it was the hardest on her you know she said it was like living always just just before dawn when everyone's asleep and you feel totally by yourself and it's just you and your regrets she called them concerns but that's what she meant regrets yeah when everything happened with Michael it was <sighs> yeah I know the feeling I just we should not do the Clarissa plan it's not a good idea it's not good at all. It's for the best, Jonas, all right? I guess Maggie was the one who had this place turned into a park. After the fort closed, I used the considerable resources from my father's endowment to buy up most of the land or influence government officials to declare that which I could not buy protected. I have not been entirely successful and have watched in horror as a small tourist industry has precariously sprung upon this cursed island. Even the family of one of the sailors who died, Calvin Gilbert, set up a restaurant to cater to inquisitive out-of-towners. I can promise this, though. The museum will never happen, and the beach and caves will be boarded up. Hmm. You don't know. We don't know what would have happened otherwise. We can just go to the boat and go home now. Alex, just just think about it. I How do I get back? I just want to say, I just, I think it would have been a interesting us living together for whatever senior year. And I'm just glad I met you, that's all. I'm just glad we met. <laughs> I'm glad too, okay? So there, it's out in the open, we're both glad. Okay, good. So, that's it. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. And we're gonna be fine, by the way. There's no... you don't have to put it like it would have been whatever to live together. We are gonna live together, and you're someday soon gonna eat all the peanut butter, and when I go make a sandwich, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> all right. Siblings. Siblings. Sibling tings. That actually is kind of what it's like to have a sibling. Them eating all the food and leaving you none. All right, we're gonna go meet up with Ren and um, Nona, and we're gonna get out of here. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hopefully make it out of here safe. Safe and sound. 5 a.m. Okay, I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight, but you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. Who's Ash? Oh, you mean Amanda? My really good friend Amanda who's moving away forever? That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. 
and I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, because whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can... No promises! Mm, nope, not promising that. What's the point in living if not to boost cars for an underworld criminal empire? I guess I can't answer that. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. But you, you know what I mean. Wow, big man on campus. I don't know why I said that. Big step, that's what I mean. Big step. Eh, it's not a big deal. I'm just letting you know, so, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why, I just wanted to tell you. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. Why does he the, like her? Uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. Ugh, Michael, come on. You're graduating in like three months. Shouldn't you be coasting? Hey, I am coasting. This just happened to be slightly fun. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny. I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that everybody here knows me, you know? I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. You were... are great, though, and... And you're gonna be great, whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well. <laughs> uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when hmm. we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Huh, that's actually, that's not bad. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> shut up! Oh, shut up! Oh, that was a nice little flashback. I really like our brother. I really like him. He's nice. Alex? Shut up, shut... Uh, you got, you know, you went bad again? I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done, now. I'm fine, let's, we can go, let's go. Come on, it's all right. No, I just always do the poster. I mean, you get the option, right? The... You guys, uh, doing okay? Yeah, it's, we're fine. But Ren, wait, seriously. In AP English, all you had to do was make a fake book cover poster at the end of the semester? Yeah, but the trick is you have to claim you're a kinesthetic learner. Yeah, I think you can worry about that after we're off the island, Ren. No, I need to worry about it now. Why? Because I left my book on the ferry. <laughs> I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghost or whatever, but... You've been acting like... Not you. Ren. No, I just, I don't know. Well, I tried. I mean, I don't know what else I could have done, man. This night has been awful nonstop. It was a lot to juggle. I know. I don't, I don't know why I'm even saying this now. I'm sorry. This is stupid, but can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and somebody finds it or something. Come on, let's do it. Let's enter the bomb shelter. Right, let's take it. Alex, get in here. Oh, a picture? You're not getting out of it. We have more pressing issues, and they're like, selfie. I don't care if you think your hair looks pointy. <sighs> All right. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. I'm ready. Let's do this thing. Aw, group selfie. We all look very, very excited for what is to come. 6 a.m. Listen, Alex. 
out. I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is, I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's kind of getting worse. Just hang in there, Jonas, okay? I know you feel like a garbage snowman right now, but we're almost done. Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Have you heard this one? Mm, no clue. Tim. You call him Tim. <laughs> oh, brother. Yeah, it's not one of my friends. That was a bad one. It's... It feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Wait, like, if, if oh, Yugoslavia damn, or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads, I don't know if this place would have held up. I don't like these ones. These ones are so time consuming. Wait, before- Nice! Look, if something happens on the other side of this door, just don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. Do whatever you have to. Don't talk like that, all right? Nothing's going to happen. There's no way this ends like that. We won't let it. I'm not asking, I'm telling. All right, fine. I'll leave you with your guts hanging out on the side of the road at the first provocation. That's what I want to hear. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, you what? know what? There, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. What? There's something going on with... Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? Yeah, I... it, it's probably a trick, Jonas. The ghosts know we're closing in on, on booting them out, and they're throwing up distractions to distract you. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. But, I mean, it, it's ghosts. And I'm not about to throw away the possibility this is something else. I'll be fast, but it's just too strange. All right, I know what you're thinking, and Jonas, I'm sorry, but chances are remote that this is, like, your actual mom collect calling you from the grave or something. Yeah, but how remote, really? It's, like, breaking or something. Can you, can you fix it? I mean, it's just so crazy to keep here. Gosh, I have to do everything. It's, it sounds like it's her. Like a recording, or it's just... It's my mom. It's That's not. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but you can hear that. The voice, right? Jonas, I, I think we should go. Really. Wait, wait, wait. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. It's not possible. I think it's... Like, it could be, right? It's just... W with everything that's happened, she could have come here. I... Jonas, I'm sorry, but I, I really don't think that's her. Like, really her. Well, how would you know? And I mean, you don't know that for sure. Well, I'm not saying I know that for sure, but from the stuff we've seen tonight, it just... This has to be possible, right? God, no. She's like so close. You can just... Can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even... No clue what's going on, but... Jonas, I know this is tough to understand, but we really should be using the radio to get out of here, and, like, that's it. We have to leave. We don't have to leave. You just want to leave. Come on, I'm sorry, but please, can you try and understand what's happening here? Just please help me out. Fine. Oh, shut up. I just can't... I just can't really get this to change, or... Uh, Mom, can you... Uh, I hate 
hate doing this. I guess I'm going through the door. I'm going through the door by myself. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous, I tell ya. Did you get lost, or are you just extraordinarily forgetful? We had a contract burned into this girl's spinal column, Alex. You shouldn't be here for our transition. Leave for the boat before we get distressed. I, I, I can't leave, actually, even if I wanted to at this point. The door's sealed behind us. I'm, I'm here for Clarissa. Then you have truly drowned yourself. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. We're not going back. We won't go back. Excuse me? All right. It's time. It's time. It's time for the radio. Lots of triangles. That's a big one. Where am I? This isn't... God. I'm in the upside down. This is like what it looks like when Eleven's in the Upside Down. Oh my god, this is insane. So she's stuck. Oh! <laughs> I'm just like sitting here waiting for something to happen. It's radio time. None of them are working. Oh, 140, right? 140.1. Maybe it's that station. What am I supposed to be listening to? I can walk. 
Jonas, are you... Are you in here somewhere? Anybody? Clarissa? Guess not. What the heck? What the heck? You've come to close the hole. Right, Well, you're gonna find out it's not that simple. The horses have already left the barn. Yeah, I've come to close the hole. I've come to... to do what Maggie Adler tried to do 50 years ago, all right? <laughs> okay, well, it didn't work then. Why would it work now? God, you're so spoiled. You don't even know the cost of things. <laughs> Closing the hole with your stupid toy will spare your... your friends from our bloom, sure. But it will seal you up in here with us. You'll die with us again and again. Well, it'd be an alright way to go if it meant saving some people you care about. One last chance. You don't have to die. You can leave, you know. Through the gate you opened. And we keep the girl. Leave Clarissa. What's... Wait, if I just want to walk out, you'll... you'll let me? But you'll... you're still gonna take Clarissa? That's it? That's it? Do you want more? A better bargain? That's all you'll get. That's more than we ever had. Do you think we wanted to be thrown away? Like some faulty appliance? We won't let it end like that. We can't. How can I fix it then? Just... just tell me how to fix it. I'm here. I'm in the the past, for God's sake. I can't change this somehow? No, you can't change. Before, you can't change anything. We can feel this binding. You have maybe just a few moments left. There's my friends. We what we do, but, but you have to know why that everyone chose to forget about us. Everyone just shuttered us away into a back closet of their thoughts. Maggie remembered. She wanted to help you. It, it was all she did was, was try and figure out what had happened. We've watched her in every timeline. Watched her try and understand. Out of guilt, maybe. All I know is she cared. She did care about you and the accident and, yes, what she did. You're a fool if you think that. It won't hurt, we don't think. The change. <laughs> but we hope the trip was worth it. Seeing the depraved tourist trap they built on our purpose. Did you see the gift shop? You can buy a little submarine flat rest if you fancy that sort of thing. Enjoy the scenery. Gets old after a while, believe us. We will not see each other again. This conversation is meaningless. I don't use this. I think I'm gonna try to save her. I don't want. I think I'm gonna try to save her. I think I'm supposed to use this. I could be completely wrong. Whatever. All right. Let's leave oh, Clarissa. You know a good burger when you see one. Let's stay good. Yeah, I'm. I I just want to go home. Believe us when we say we understand completely. Okay, so let me leave. Goodbye, Alex. God gave us memory, the saying goes. But that is all he gave us. Remember Clarissa as she was. She was. So remember your friends as they were. Because they will never be that. Ever again. Oh, so th then my friends are gonna hate me now? Ah, oh, I'll take my chances. What? 
does any of that mean? Jonas? Jonas, where... Where are you? Oh, okay. This is... This is gonna be fine. Just... Work through it. Don't tell Michael what to do about Clarissa, okay? But... Michael's... Dead. How could I even... Whoa, wait. What... What's happening? What the heck? What the heck? Is this like flashbacks? Whoa, are you... Look, is someone there? Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. When Jonas gets on your, uh, case about his mom, just do what you feel is best, okay? His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. W what is... H how is this possible? W what's going on? What? <sighs> well, that could have gone better. These are all the mirrors <sighs> we right. passed? Time loop. Just don't try and influence Michael. He can live his own life. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. <sighs> hmm. Oh, is... Oh, this is my bedroom. Pretty nice house. Ooh, Michael. Michael, Michael. <laughs> oh, hey. I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Are you back? Are we back now, or...? Uh, yeah, I'm back. I was only going to be at Terry's house for the game. I've been, like, struggling with the stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have like a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. I... I don't know. I, I don't think it has to have a point. Well, that's where we differ, sister. I think things should have points. Things should be sharp. They should poke you. I'm guessing mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. Well, uh, what are you thinking? Engineering? Well, you said something about sports medicine one time. Yeah, I don't know about that anymore. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni and... Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I've bored you enough. I'm boring me right now. Michael, say it. Come on, you can't take me to the water's edge of an idea here and then not jump in. That's just cruel. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. Listen, here's the... <sighs> you can't tell mom or dad, but Clarissa and I are talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and... and just doing our own thing. Oh, Michael, seriously? You'd leave me here all alone with these boring, bland people who... who don't come up with stuff like grocery cart chariot race? You came up with that one, so... You're not really losing out. I'd still visit all the time, so... you know... She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and uh, I'm into the idea. I really am. I just, I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your, like, blessing first. So, can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say, Don't go! To do this? <sighs> Michael, you, you have a lot that you can do and a lot ahead of you, and, and I don't think tying yourself to your high school girlfriend in such a risky way is the smart play here. Yeah. It's not supposed to be. It's not supposed to be the safe play. That's, like, the whole thing of it, but... I know what you're saying. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them. It feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. And match every beer with a water. And take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. Michael, what is... What's this for? What, what are you doing? This is just... This is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. And I love you, and you're amazing, and that's it. So... I love you too. 
What the heck? But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, look who's finally awake. Maybe don't get up immediately. Michael, how... What's happening? Well, it's a combination of things, I guess. Michael carried you here from the cave. Because you were, you know, comatose. She doesn't. It's okay. You don't care. What's happening is that the tuning thing we did in the cave, it worked. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Or at least they've... They've stopped trying to eat our souls. Yeah, but, it's... Uh, okay, good to know. Great. Hooray. But how exactly is Michael here right now? What do you mean? Yeah, I've been here all night. Are you feeling okay? I mean, we all feel pretty bad, You but... don't remember Michael coming with us? Uh, wait, you're saying you've been here all night. Like, you took the boat with us? Uh -huh. You were gonna camp out? I took the boat. We went to the cave. We... I mean, come on, kiddo. It's been you and me all night. We did the call to, to open the bomb shelter. Oh my god. You don't remember this. That was Jonas and I. Jonas and I slogged through the forest to get Ren. Jonas and Alex, I Alex, I was with Ren when you and Mike picked us up. Yeah, I mean, Jonas has been with me the whole time. Which, what? You know, terrible way to show you what we do here for fun, by the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I invited the poor guy. He just moved here with his dad, and... Um, no, seriously, it was somehow worked out. Guys, no, Jonas. I brought Jonas. He's my new stepbrother. His dad is marrying... He's marrying our mom. <laughs> oh, what? boy. Alex, maybe you should lie down again. Yeah, this is... Jonas, come on. It's you and me now, pal. We had, like, a year's worth of memories in one eight-hour span. You know me. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I don't know you. No, not really. And it's not like I don't want to know you. I mean, you know, we can, like, hang out or something when we get back. Like, during the year, you know? I'm just, uh... I'm sorry. I can't believe this. It's okay, come on, it's alright. We'll all get back into the swing of things, start feeling our freshness again soon enough, I'm sure. I can't believe everything that happened. I just... I feel like we should tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but... What? No, are you kidding? We have... Well, we don't have evidence of ghosts, but we know there's a continuation, a, a sort of life after death. This is like the moon landing times a billion. Is this... Rin, didn't you lose a book? Holy crap! This is it! Thank you! I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, or... that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, oh, prom. Prom. You guys had fun with that. Are you going, Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flats? No Thank way! You. I spent homecoming eating bottomless fries at that fast food emporium and... I'm gonna stick with that plan for this, I think. All right, you know what? It's picture time. Oh my god. Come on. Oh, come Mona. on, what? We earned this one. Let's do it. <sighs> yeah, I guess we should. Tonight's been, um, noteworthy. Noteworthy. That is a way to say it. Yeah, I'd probably say it another way. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Sure. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half the time. Here's good for the... yeah, just here. Like, look. I'll just pick a random-ass page. Come on, Alex, get in. Like, this, here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Okay, everyone. Wait, didn't you... Cheese! Cheese! Selfie! Ooh! Aww, a nice group Before pick. Before we left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. Ren always loved the town, but the island pretty much erased that in one fell swoop. He ended up going to college in California. He was my best friend, but I don't know if I'll ever see him again. What? You and 32% of players that kept Ren and Nona from dating. Nona, I think, is going to some ballet academy somewhere, but I kind of fell out of touch with her, to be honest. Nobody remembers Clarissa. 
Except me, of course. <laughs> She's not I even in the picture. Every single day, to be honest. I don't know hmm. if it was the right thing to do. I think most people would say it wasn't, but most people will never have to face something like that. You and 6% of players sacrifice Clarissa! <laughs> Oh my god, what's wrong with me? I'm an Since evil person. Michael never left. We never had our going away thing at the lake, and so he never drowned. He stayed in town to get an engineering degree. He's content, but he sometimes thinks he would have been happier trying to go out on his own. I don't know. You and several percent of players brought Michael back and stopped his relationship with Clarissa. Wow, so he is alive. Jackson and I hung out just once more, but it was different awkward. I never saw him again after school ended. I used to think that was kind of sad, you know? But I don't anymore. Things are what they are. You and 6% of players did not bond with Jonas. Nobody likes me. <laughs> it's funny. What happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day. And then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's... <sighs> I don't know. It's good, I think. But anyways, I, um... Well... If it matters. I left town for school. I left town! I left town to go to school. Undeclared. I need time to figure out what I... What I want, I guess. But anyways... Oh, what time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Ren's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing. And I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. <sighs> I hope he's not weird or mean or something. Whatever. I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right? That's it. I'm a horrible person. That's what I have realized now. Everybody hates me. I sacrificed Clarissa even though I didn't really mean to. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's crazy. Okay, get escape. Escape. Are these credits long? Oh my gosh, that's crazy. That is crazy. Can't even believe my outcomes here. There's nothing else. process all this. I kind of don't understand some of it, but some of it I'm like, oh, the dots have connected. <gasps> Michael's in these pictures now. Come on. 
Hi, Manny. What's up, buddy? My dog's probably so tired of being trapped in here. Well, there it is. My outcome of the game. I literally got the lowest percentage of outcome for everybody. I am truly unique. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. That was crazy. Wow. I am truly unique here. All right, well, that's the end. I'm gonna close out of it. Close it. Wow. Well, that was a really good game. I actually really did enjoy it. I was getting really into it and I was really trying to figure things out. I feel like I'm still confused on some things, but some things definitely, you know, tied together at the end there during those explanations on what happened to each character. I cannot believe I got like the lowest percentage for every character at the end. I feel like every character hated me, even though like I wasn't trying to hurt anyone's feelings. I didn't really want to leave Clarissa behind. I really couldn't figure out how to save her, so I just got lazy and left. But I really meant to save her. But it is what it is. Um, it was really fun. Um, it was a shorter game for sure. So I really like short story games like this. I find them really interesting and this one was really well made so I really enjoyed it. I'm excited for when the second one comes out. I think it comes out sometime next year. So yeah, when it comes out I'll definitely play the second one. But yeah, this one was super fun. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing me play it and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Have a good rest of your Friday. I will be back on tomorrow. Bye. I eat.